So quite recently, Adobe has been hogging the limelight for its amazing creations and announcements at Adobe Max 2016, which is one of the world's biggest creative conferences. But just when things were going to cool down a little bit for Adobe, it played a masterstroke. What it did, it acquired Tube Mogul for a whooping $541 billion. Now, what this deal means to you and how this will affect Adobe and what's in it for Adobe, all this coming up. So before we begin, let me know down in the comments below what you think about Adobe as a brand. So fresh news coming in. So what is Tube Mogul? So Tube Mogul specializes in video advertising. Now Adobe is acquiring Tube Mogul. Why? You see, Snapchat, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, things are becoming video savvy and video marketing has become a huge field and it's, it's blooming, right? It's exploding. So things are becoming quite video centric and there's a lot of money involved. Adobe has foreseen this and it has bought Tube Mogul. Now what Tube Mogul will do? Now Adobe has its own marketing cloud its marketing platform. What it will do, what Adobe plans to do, is that to provide you, customers, with a place where you can place video advertisements. So you can use Adobe, right? Adobe as a brand to place your advertisements as video. So Adobe is playing a masterstroke in this by uh, allowing you to make your own video ads to reach anyone you want. Tube Mogul can reach your customer irrespective of where they are. It gives you a lot of customizations as to which blogs do you want to post your advertisements to, right? Which TV channels you want to air your advertisements to according to your target audience. It gives you a plethora of options for video marketing. It's, it's a genius. Tube Mogul is a genius in video marketing. Also, there is fresh news coming in that Adobe is trying to become an ad buying platform. It will become an ad buying platform. It will include that feature where in its marketing cloud. So guys, that's all for today. To know more about Project Felix, Adobe's first ever venture into 3D softwares and stuff, click in this end card here. To know more about Adobe's controversial Project Voco that allows you to edit voices, just like text, just type anything and it will say it. Click here and do consider subscribing and I'll see you guys in my next video. Till then, stay tuned and happy photoshopping.